What's up you guys, Operation Gamer here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VII Remake. In the last episode, we uh, took on a battle arena, and then we got Madam M's approval, and we did some side quests. So, today, we're going to be checking in on Aerith, and seeing if her, if she looks alright in her dress and all that. If it goes the way I think it is, you're about to see a lot of cringing, so I hope you guys are ready for that. But anyway, let us... Make sure... Oh, also, I forgot to mention, I was showing Micah this game. I was just kind of running around and looking at other things. I uh, did a couple things. First off, I did... I got to the next level in the uh, squatting competition. Completely failed at pro. And I'm not trying that shit. I'm good. <laughs> but I also unlocked something. I did one fight in the battle arena, and I unlocked something. Uh, I unlocked the ascension limit break. Or level 2 limit break. So... We're gonna go into it with that and uh, see where things go from there. But anyway, let's do it. Let's check in on Aerith. No! Whoa! Whoa! Cloud, finally! <sighs> Tifa, she, I, Tifa, she, she's, I don't. Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon, and Tifa's, Tifa's gonna be. I just... I, I, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud. Bro. I can call you bro, right? Nope. <laughs> I just want to say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. They call themselves the brain. So, like, how'd you get so strong anyway, bro? I said... The way you fight, bro, is like the poetry and violence. Bam, bam, whoosh, whoosh, you know? I really wish I could be just like you. My problem is that I tend to overthink and overanalyze everything. So, well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but uh, I have a feeling that I'll just be getting in the way. Yeah. Yes. Go find Aerith at Madame M's. Tell her to wait for me there when she's done. Think you can handle that? Yes, sir. Let's go. Sup, motherfuckers? Guess who's back? You again? Got a letter of approval right here. Hmm? You know that's only good for women, right? Yeah, it's for Aerith. Who? Oh, that girl you were with. Sorry to hear that. Well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. I can't let you in. I wasn't asking for permission. Huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you don't want to screw with the Don. I want to screw with you, though. If you even I'm think about ass. causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break out. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition won't start for a while. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl and the letter. But if I were you, I wouldn't. Yeah, well, I don't give a shit what you say. Aerith's gonna win. No, I, Aerith's gonna come in, and we're gonna kick your ass, and... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, by the way, this is the first video I'm recording with my new setup, so hopefully you guys like that. Uh, it doesn't matter. That's not part of the video. Anyway, let's go. Alright. Let's go get Aerith. Red carpet, really? Ma'am. Hey, yeah. Uh. Wow. That's really 
Yeah. Corneo's got certain tastes. This dress is so gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Loud? <laughs> Excuse me. Huh. Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. Oh, thanks. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition? No way in hell I'll let you go in there by yourself. By myself? Oh, don't worry. I wasn't gonna. Come on, you'll see. Do what? See what, exactly? According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous someone, and they'd like to meet in person. Huh? Oh, God. I'm a little nervous, but okay. You're, you're, you're in my party, and how are you, how exactly are you gonna fight like that? She's probably not going to, Justin. Stop. But... Look at you all dolled up and fabulous. Where are you? Well, what do we have here? Everyone, you, 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 you get your ass out of here. You see the giant girl fucking thing on my back? I will kick your ass. Why am I defending her? I, because she's, she's, she's in my party. Oh, fuck off, dude. Wow. I'm... My, like, brotherly instincts just fucking kicked in. Last time that happened... Oh, never mind. Justin, stop talking. Anyway, I told you guys it was gonna be extreme cringe. But anyway... I will kill you, whoever... I will kill whoever tries to even place a hand on her. To see the honeybee ends Andrea Rodea and convince him to give you his stamp of approval. You said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. Huh? It'll be fun. And honestly, I think you'll look pretty cute in a dress. But what? <laughs> it's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in what? someone. At least that's what Madame M said. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh. Come on. Oh Don't you yeah. Save Tifa? Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. So, here's how I think we should approach him. Madame M said Andrea was a man who'd give anyone a fair chance to win him over. So I say we march right up to him, explain the situation, and see where that gets us. Sound good? I forgot. I saw it in the trailer. And a while ago, people were showing me pictures of Cloud in a dress. Is that what the... Is that what the choice affects? Oh god. So what did, what did doing Chocobo, Sam, Chocobo Sam's thing do? I'm intrigued. Good evening. Welcome to the entertainment extravaganza that is the Honeybee Inn. You already knew. No We're way. here to see Andrea Rodea. You must be Mr. Cloud. He's waiting for you. Mr. Cloud? I've been instructed to send you through without delay, sir. Please. Make your way to the stage in the back. What stage? The one in the back, sir. Straight through those doors and down the hall. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. And I just got more flashbacks. Okay, we're going. We're going in. I dreamt of this moment. The honeybee is. Oh, my God. Oh, no. No, no. Do not be lined up. The man of the hour, chosen by Andrea himself. You touch me, I, I our beat you. Guest. Let's go. This is your first time, right? It's okay. Do you want to practice your dance moves first? My hoodoo, what a Why would I want to do that? Andrea thought it might be a good idea. Over here, come on now. Hey, hold on. <laughs> dance practice. Press the buttons in time of the music. Oh no, this is a rhythm game. No, fuck. Okay, I guess, I guess it'll uh, prepare me for me Melody of Memory, I guess, but oh no. Uh, using the rhythm line as guides, color, the button, button, 
button positions on the guide show you which buttons to press. Watch the buttons closely and get ready to press them when the panel and the line are right on top of each other. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> This is... We're dancing with our sword? Delicious. Do not call it delicious. Stop. You've got real rhythm, mister. Move over, girls. A new dancer's come to town. No, I think I'll be fine. Probably. Come on, come on. If my sanity isn't gone by the end of this episode. What the fuck did I just sign up for? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. My, my. Is that Cloud? Oh, no. No, no, no. Darling. I had no idea. <laughs> Hello there, Sam. You? Will you just sit tight until Andrea takes the stage? Look at his muscles. Aw, he's flushing. <laughs> he looks so uncomfortable. Just as uncomfortable as I am right now. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know if this is copyrighted, so I'm just gonna talk over it. I don't know. Ah. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. God. I don't. I can't. I can't process right now. Why? Why is this happening? Oh no. Why? Of any? Oh. God. What? Why? Oh. oh no. Oh, hello, Aerith. Oh no. Okay. Okay, okay. Welcome to the Humvee Inn, Cloud. You seek my approval, do you? But those who crave my favor must first prove that they know how to move. Oh no. Oh god, my sword is gone. <laughs> Stop, Aerith. Do not. Do not. I was just starting to like. No, I shouldn't say that. That's weird. Okay, fine. Oh no. <laughs> Alright, Cloud. Let's do this together. Think you can follow my lead? Let's go. Okay. This is somewhat bearable. dynamic, I guess. Shut up, Aerith. Stop. Just stop. The, the moving camera doesn't really help that much, but hey. Oh, 
whatever. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Not even a fucking smile. Stop it, Aerith. Stop, please. You're making me cringe even more. Not bad, Clad. You know, for a second, it actually seems like Cloud's starting to have a little bit of fun. Which is not that- which is not bad. Nice move! <laughs> I love it! <laughs> Honey. I'm in love. No! No! Yes. Oh. Yes, I will transform you into a vision of beauty. Now, without further ado, let us begin! Oh, we're doing this in front of everyone. Okay. Putting on, oh, we're doing makeup too. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> you were born for this. You, you look like you're about to have a fucking heart attack. Oh god. <laughs> Just unfazed. Actually, it doesn't look half bad on him. Andrea's earrings obtained. Dancing Queen. Oh god. Without shame, to which notions of gender don't apply. Don't ever be afraid of that. Okay, you know. Oh, that oh, show today we're playing as Aaron. My mind. As much as that part made me cringe, me. I don't think it's. I, I like that. I, I think it was fun. Now that was a was show. Was it from the start? Probably not. Cloud. Did you see their look of surprise? Yoo-hoo, Cloud. Hello. Don't. The man's embarrassed. Come on. Eric to Cloud, come in. Eric to Cloud, come in. Cloud. Please don't. Not a word. Not even one? No, what one? But you're so pretty. Oh my god. Stop, Aerith. Let's just let's just go to the mansion and just never fucking speak of this again. Also, where's my sword? I want my sword! <laughs> Anyone who's gonna make fun of me, I'm gonna slash you. Yeah, you know what? You know what? You know what? Fuck it. If we're gonna go like this, we're gonna go- we're gonna fucking be proud of it. We're gonna stand up and we're gonna be proud. Also, from what I- Also, um, another thing. 
Uh, I was Whoa. shown picture of the other of the other uh, dresses, and oh god, I think there was like a purple one or something. I don't remember, but I didn't know that this was. I I thought it was just like a. I don't I don't know how to how to explain this, but. This guy's gonna recognize me off the spot. No way. Here you are. Letters from Andrea Rodea and Madame M. That ought to do the trick, right? You serious? Is there a problem? I hope you know what you're in for. Oh, we'll be fine. If you say so. Come on. Aerith, are you coming? If I win, I swear to God. The two of you here for the audition? Second floor, at the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong. Why not? What if you guys have treasures? Which, from what it looks like, you, you have a lot. You can't afford a single thing in this place, so don't break shit. But there's a, but there's a thing back there. There's a chest. You can't afford a single thing in this place, so don't break shit. I better be able to come back down here and get these chests. If not, I'm gonna find you and I'm gonna kill you. You specifically. You are my main target, cause fuck you. I don't know why, I just don't like your face. Or your voice. I need to calm the fuck down. I am angry. Get the fuck out of here. I will kill you. <laughs> We've been waiting for you to show. Can I walk past you? Good. That Andrea's girl? I'd let her do things to me. Room's at the end. Keep walking. Ooh. Right here? I'm guessing I should be able to explore this place more, but... I can't believe this is happening. Are they actually going to buy this? Huh? What's that weird, sweet smell? They're drugging us. Why do I feel so They're drugging dizzy? us. No! Yes. Come on. They're locked us in. They locked us in. Damn it. Cloud. Shit. <laughs> you assholes. <laughs> you touch her, I kill you. Taking us. You touch her, I kill you. <laughs> You touch her, I kill you. Why am I so aggressive? Hey, can you hear me? Hey, Tifa. Uh, oh. Tifa? Yes? You okay? Mm-hmm. Good. Wait a minute. <gasps> Cloud? Is that you? Oh my god, that makeup! And that dress! Nailed it, I know, thank you. Moving on. <laughs> Keep moving on! <sighs> you good? Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. <sighs> hey, Tifa, how you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, right. I'm Aerith. A friend of Cloud's. We were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks? Cut the chatter. We gotta leave. Huh? Right now. Uh, no, not until I got what I came for. What? So, after we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were interested in Avalanche. But... I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. 
Seriously? Thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time, but then I realized I'd only be one of three candidates, and that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here, right? Uh, right. <laughs> so yeah, if we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You, me, Cloud? Makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? I don't know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. Oh, Cloud gets me. <sighs> Took you long enough. The cringe. The cringe is so real. So what happens now? I think they'll call for us when it's time. This room gives me the creeps. The cringe is so real. I can't. I just fucking can't. Oh. Turbo. Did I just kick the chest? Find that off the bat. Oh, I don't have enough. Well then, I'm buying an ether at least. Phoenix down. Can I sell anything? I can. sell a lot of my shit. There we go. And I think other than that, I think we're good unless there's more shit I can buy, but... Oh man, the cringe is so real. I can't even... Oh, and apparently... Now ladies, listen up! I'm sure you're still feeling a bit woozy, but tonight's audition's about to begin! Head out the door to the left and up the stairs! Come on, ladies, let's hustle! Alright, guys, let's do this. <laughs> do you want to do this? Not really, but we don't talk about this. Um, also, um, what was it? God damn it. What's our turn to say? Oh, yeah. Apparently, in Chapter 3, what you chose with Tifa after your little talk about what she wants to wear, that, that affects that. That, that, that. That's what I learned. Uh, my friend asked me, oh, which dress did which, uh, what did you pick? I said, I chose it random. It did sporty. I'm like, well, I hope you like leopard. I'm like, what? Well, I didn't realize it until now. <laughs> but. Anyway. I'm curious about what the other dresses were, but I'll find that on, on a different playthrough. I swear to God, okay, if I get picked. Okay, my beautiful ladies, time to line up for the dawn. Oh God, you again. Mm. Mm. Wait, you look kind of familiar. We haven't met before, have we? Mm -mm. Yeah. Good. Good. Uh, whatever. All right. Y'all good to go? Then let's do this thing. Do I gotta dance again? Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Don Corneo. Ladies? Uh. Nice. What the fuck Very is that? Nice. <laughs> Whichever one shall I pick? <laughs> Oh, I kill you. Oh, I beat the crap out of you. I swear to God, if you touch either one of them, I'll kill you. Or maybe you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. You might die. You might die. You might die. Oh yeah! I've got it! I've got it! Today's bride to be is... Today's? And tomorrow's, or the day after, if the dawn takes a shine to you. Pathetic. Huh? Oh, hey! 
Which one of you said that? Was it you? Ooh, you got a mouth on you. I'm going to enjoy breaking it in. Did I win? Today's lucky lady is the big bone girl. <laughs> Still playing hard to get? I can dig it. Oh, yeah. You're going to have a lot of disappointment coming your way. Leftovers dude. are all yours. Huh? Yeah, yeah. Excuse me? Okay, ladies. Y'all come with me. Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give daddy some sugar. No need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, you're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Ooh. <laughs> you can't even tell that I'm a guy? I love it. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna kill him. He's gonna die. What was that? Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. Oh, and hey guys, sure he fell in love with a guy. Inappropriate, like say no, asshole. Oh, praise me more. <laughs> hey, yo, fellas, we got guests, and y'all got first crack at entertaining them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Courtesy of the ever generous Don Corneo himself. Never forget the Don provides. I hate this yeah. guy. Yeah! Yeah! Oh! I'm kill them. They're all gonna die. Please let me fight them. So, as Tifa. Ready to get to it? Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? Hmm. Four guys between us. Okay. Let's not keep Cloud waiting. Right. Wait. I know you. Coliseum. Oh! Oh! This is even better. I like this. Oh! Oh God! Good job, Eric. It was nothing compared to you. I love that. I love that. I love that. Hello there again. Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come bearing gifts. My sword! Gear. My sword, my sword! <sighs> I'll do what I can to clean this up. Just finish the job. Are you on oh, my side? Thank you! Nice! Yeah! Back in action! Back in costume! Back in uniform! Who am I okay, playing as? Let's go Tifa. The oh no. Right? Eric. You know what? I'm fine. I'm fine either way. This is awesome. I love this. This was beautiful. Better hurry. Better hurry. All right, let's go. You know what? I'm fine. I'm fine with this. Man, I'd love to spend some quality time because like that. Bet they're going at it right now. Lucky bastards. <laughs> What are you doing here? Oh, yeah, we're fighting! Can you take over for me? I love- I, I love how Aerith fights, but this is so much more satisfying just to punch these fuckers in the face. Oh shit. Go Not on. even paying attention to me, I'll smack your ass. And we're safe. Oh, this is fun. This was de the build up was definitely worth it for this. <laughs> Don't stop. Tell me what you a bad boy bastard. I am. Bastard. <laughs> yes, yes I am! Here I come, baby! Yeah. Ah! Oh. Yeah. Hey, who the hell gave you permission to do that? I did. 
One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners. Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners too. What the? Cloud, your clothes. <laughs> oh. You're about to have a hard realization. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so you're a man, huh? What are you three up to? <laughs> we'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Man. Huh? Don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Why did you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Spill the beans, or... I'll cut them off. Ooh. All right, all right! <laughs> I'll talk, I'll oh. talk! <sighs> uh, some guy with a gun for an arm! I was paid to find him! Paid by who? I can't tell you that! They'd hunt me down like a dog! Well, you better. Because if you don't, I'll rip them off! Oh. <laughs> it was the director of public security, Heidegger. It was Heidegger. Yep. Shinra. And what were they planning? Yeah. Some things are better left wow. unsaid, you know. See, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking. Or I'll smash them. <laughs> 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 All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Did I stutter? The plate will come crashing down. <laughs> It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7 is gonna look like. Oh, no. They wouldn't. Come on, guys. We gotta go. Before you do... No. Please, this won't take long. As everyone knows, villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation? <laughs> when they think they've already won, right? Ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a winner! You get an all-expenses-paid trip to the sewers. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy the sights and smells! <laughs> oh, that was chapter 9. Alrighty. As much as that made me cringe, I'm enjoying this game more and more. Wow, that was fun. I really enjoyed that. Hello there again. Are we on schedule? <laughs> the Turks are on top of it. Yes, there will be no delays. Please, Mr. President. I am asking you to reconsider. No, begging. The Sector 7 Undercity is home to more than 50,000... <sighs> Director Twisty. At least let us issue a warning, sir. The stench of the director's cowardice fills the room yet again. <laughs> we. Progress requires sacrifice. Learn to live with it. Chapter 10 Rough Waters. Oh.
Damn it, Reeks. All right, and true to the nature, that is going to be the end of Chapter 9. I think I'm going to start my recording over, and I'm going to continue to play, because I don't want to stop there. Are you kidding me? <laughs> this is just getting interesting. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Do what you guys do in that YouTube. Follow me on Twitter at Camera one all that cool stuff. And now we got all three... <laughs> the brides to be in the party. This is going to be fun. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.